Okay, this is Trap Red with the with the uh, New York State legal muskrat trap configuration. As you can see, these locks, I've replaced the bungee type arrangements with these springs. They're a little bit short. It's a little bit taut. So I'll probably end up getting a little longer springs, but they attach like such. These springs were fairly cheap. They were like 50 cents a piece at the local hardware store. We call them uh, extension springs or door springs. But uh, as you can see, the lock is controlled by the springs themselves. This little gizmo got broken, so I had to put them both on the same. And anyways, I need a latch hook to hold that lock em in place so I can lift up the door and set the trigger otherwise it's too powerful but as you can see this with this type of an arrangement there's no way outside of bending this which this is going to be replaced with a solid piece of metal <clears throat> outside of bending this lock there's no way once the door closes for the door to open plus I left a little <coughs> Spikes on the end to discourage, you know, escape. They don't want to put their snout in that kind of thing. Anyways, this is just for muskrats. They're not that strong, and this would be set underwater, so its capability would be to catch one at a time, which is all it will do once it's triggered in a sw swim through. Now that's not to say two muskrats couldn't be swimming through. Uh, simultaneously one on the other one's butt and two get caught but that would be what would be referred to as an accidental catch and so that wouldn't be illegal that just be good luck but you never know you know uh, you get you get uh, certain conservation officers that are hell-bent for leather on charging a guy with something and they'll dream up anything just to get you know some kind of litigation win. Anyway, because that's what they get paid for, you know. Our country's become a, a country of litigation, courts and trials, where everybody's guilty until proven innocent, and your uh, phone system's being spied upon right now. They're eaves eavesdropping on this telephone conversation, uh, you know, the law enforcement people, FBI, CIA, NSA, the people that have uh, access, local law enforcement, have access to your telephone records, your telephone conversations, your private conversations. There is no such thing in America anymore as a private telephone conversation, nor is there uh, any such thing as privacy because they can enable through Google the, uh, uh, the listening devices that are the microphone and uh, such that's embedded into your telephone system and your computer and your television and your set-top box.